You do? Oh, okay, okay. What's her name? I might know. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, uh, it takes a lot of balls to do what you're doing. <laughs> They're not going to do it. They're not going to do it. They're not going to do it. Black boy joy. She want to see the forbs like I want to see her form. Tell me what you for, yeah. Hey, you pay me what I'm owed, yeah. What is going on guys and welcome to another video. Uh, today I have a listing appointment right here behind me. Um, these townhouses are three bed, actually she has three bathrooms. So that's what we're gonna be going to check out. Um, we're gonna be listing probably around the $300,000 range. Um, she has had some foundation issues repaired and done. And I think we have some competition in the area. They have a couple of these that are actually on the market, but they have not addressed the foundation issue and they're gonna be priced relatively higher by about 15 to 20 grand. So I think we'll have a much better shot of getting this sold and you know getting her the return on her investment get her into a new place that she's going to be looking to buy as well so that's what we got going on today and let's go and hop into this video i know exactly where your where your career is headed because of the way that you communicate yeah just the way that you communicate with people and really connect and you got the you do you got the right tone and the pauses and the speed and everything man the way that you communicate is just top notch first class and that is the number one skill. I need to watch Marquess Branson's video, like seriously, like 15 times. This is groundbreaking, like life-changing stuff when you listen to this guy talk, I'm serious. What's going on guys? We just finished the appointment. Really, really cool, uh, really cool girl, man. She's, you know, had some issues with the house and she's went ahead and fixed it, but she's, she's tired of the HOA. She had to do a lot just to get her own foundation done and other sorts of things. So she's looking to, you know what I'm saying, sell this house, get into a, a newer one and kind of move on to, to the next chapter of her life. She's big on entertaining, so she wants something a little more wide open, you know what I mean? So that's what we're gonna be working on. But now we're getting ready to head over to my lender partner. We're gonna go over there to their office. I just wanna, you know, st uh, spend some time with him. He's actually working on another deal that I have. So I wanna definitely, you know, talk to him about that. But then we're gonna do some cold calls there in the office, hopefully, and, you know, just, just have a, a day in the life. So if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe. Um, definitely, you know, I'm coming out with more and more content as I, I find more and more time to actually sit down and, and really, you know, do this thing. I'm new to YouTube, but I, I'm trying to give you guys the best quality possible and, you know, some really fire content. If you're appreciative, if you like it, guys, just shoot me a message in the comments, like the video, and uh, let's take it in, let's get it on. So I kind of know uh, just, with all the messages I've been getting in my comments section, with the messages I've been getting on Instagram, a lot of people are asking me, Marquez, how are you getting these listings in your first year, right? Now this is my first year in real estate and I've had 12 listings. It's because I prospect with the focus on listings, right? If you focus on buyers, you're gonna get more buyers. If you focus on listings, you'll get more listings. So I've really been tailoring my business to property owners and that's really what Ricky Carruth teaches us right uh, you focus your, your business on property owners and usually those people will sell and then also buy now this market's been a little crazy and you know I've been doing a lot of I've had a lot of uh, property owners who were leasing or renting you know landlord type of situations but as the market continues to turn more and more in those situations are gonna start coming where I'm getting two deals out of every transaction and so that's really what I've been able to do a lot of people they concentrate on like contract stuff when they first get into business and all this other stuff that's really low production. There's low productivity. Um, focus on learning to prospect. Focus on learning to talk to people and build relationships. That's where the that's where the money is, guys. Is being able to prospect. That needs to be number one. The contract and stuff will come with the deals. You'll get the experience and everything like that. So enough about that. I had a gas up, man. We were running low on gas, but we're headed over here to Arlington, Texas. You guys probably know what that is. It's the home of the Dallas Cowboys. I'm gonna take you on a nice little ride and I'll see you in just a second.
What's going on guys? So we made it to our destination here in Arlington, Texas. I'm here to meet my guy, John Muhammad at Prime Lending. If you guys don't know him, let me introduce you to him real quick. Huh? Hey, what's happening everybody? Dude. John Muhammad, I'm a loan officer here in Arlington, Texas with Prime Lending. We make it happen. My team is here with me today. Um, we specialize in first time home buyer programs, repeat buyers. We have all the products, VA, FHA, uh, USDA, you name it, construction, we can do it all. So we take pride in doing this, helping folks become homeowners. Yeah, so me and John are doing business currently. I have one of my clients in with his guys. We're gonna get this deal closed out. And right now I'm gonna probably just chop it up with him and then I'm gonna get some cold calls in while I'm probably down here and I will catch y'all in just a second. Oh yeah, 100%. Y'all have a, can I connect to y'all Wi-Fi? Mm -hmm. All right, guys, so we're here at the office getting ready to go through some cold calls, uh, get on the phone and do what we do, prospect as always every day. Uh, appreciate John allowing us to come in and kind of do our thing while we're over here. And uh, you know how we do it, so let's hop right in. As far as prospecting, John, do y'all do anything like that or y'all just kind of? No, we, I've been a part of the core. The core teaches lenders to focus on your craft and servicing your real trip partners. Don't buy leads, don't just do that, mm -hmm. you'll be successful. And I have been in doing so, but um, I do want to expand and do some lead gen stuff. Yeah, that's a big, that's a big part of it. Like that's kind of what I do with the with the prospecting and whatnot. A lot of realtors don't they don't really prospect or lead gen at all. You know, like you said, they try to buy buy leads. And the crazy thing about it is you're gonna buy them from Zillow, who's gonna, you know, give you a lead that's supposed to be warm. But at the same time, you're gonna end up having to call them anyway. And when you call them, they still not gonna know who you are just because you got it from Zillow, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So if you don't have the skill of being able to talk to people, it kind of just goes for not. Quite frankly, you're just paying a lot of money for nothing. It's the feel good actions, bro. Oh yeah, absolutely. Right, that's what I'm doing. It's not, it's not, it's not actually, you're not actually being that productive, but it feels like you are, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. I've never seen that in action. What? The dialogue. You've never seen it in action? No, that's what oh. you just did, right? Oh yeah, I'm tripping. So it just called a bunch until I'm whoever tripping. picked up. Yeah, whoever pick up, then I then I go into my spiel. So it's just gonna you you got a list of people to call and it'll just and then well, whoever yeah. answers they pulled up that info. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I geo lead, so basically I just pull a neighborhood and it gives me all the information of all the property owners. And so this is the part that everybody don't do and I just build my database and then people call me when they start thinking about doing deals because I've been communicating with them. Lakers, hey, this is, Hello. can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, I was giving you a call, man. I might have the wrong number. Uh, this number's tied to this property on Wind Ridge Drive in Little Elm. Does that ring a bell at all? No, no, this is a liquor store. Liquor store? Okay, I guess I'm just off basis. I got you, no worries. Well, I'm a local real estate agent, man. You wouldn't happen to have any real estate needs, would you? What kind of real estate you sell, homes oh. or commercial? Uh, I'm pretty much in a single family arena, but I can find you somebody if you need commercial. Uh, no, if you know any, we have a liquor store here in Allen, and we're trying to sell it. It's a new, so if you know anybody wants to buy it, mm -hmm. I'll give you my cell phone. This is a... Uh, Oh, is it been okay? Yeah, what's a good cell phone number for you? And I'll see what I can do about finding you, you know, a buyer. Text me. Okay, okay. You have a good email I can shoot you some information over to? Text, send me your cell phone on that, and I'll send you a text. I'll send you an email on that. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. No worries. Okay, will do, man. Yes, sir. What is your name? Uh, my name is Mark Branson, like Branson, Missouri. Okay. Okay. Yes, sir. On, yes, sir. Uh, on the cell phone, send no. me your uh, text, uh, okay. cell phone number no, on my cell, uh, and then, uh, then I'll send you an email. Okay. okay. All right. Sounds good, man. All right. I appreciate it. Okay. All right, guys. We are finished up there at the office. Did our little calls. Uh, had a pretty good morning, so now we're about to head home out. I'm about to go and touch. Uh, I'm about to go to my favorite taco place. You guys should know it well. We're gonna get some of those. Kind of kick back and get ready to head back to the house. I uh, just got another deal on the contract. I also got another listing coming. Uh, my guy wants to put it on the market by this weekend, so that's also good. And uh, we'll keep on rolling and rolling. We'll see you in a second. guys we 
just finished getting our tacos. Getting ready, I'm headed. I'm heading home. It's been a really good day, really productive day. Uh, went on that listing appointment earlier today. Launched the listing from yesterday. Is on the market now. And now got a client calling. Hold that ball. Hey, what's going on, Will? What's going on? Man? You got it. Hey, that's a long story on that one, man. A long story. I, I, I technically own the property. The title company messed up. Uh oh. What we got? Uh, 